Hi everyone. Today we are going to study next topic spherical mirror formula for concave mirror. When an object AB is placed beyond center of curvature C, a ray parallel to in, pa, uh, parallel to principal axis after reflection passes through the focus of concave mirror and a ray passing through the center of curvature is reflected back along the same path in reverse direction because it is along the normal to spherical mirror. The two reflected rays meet at this point and hence form an image A dash B dash. Point to be noted that when an object is placed beyond C, its real inverted and diminished image is formed between C and F. Here PF is focal length, PV dash is image distance V, PC is radius of curvature R and PV is object distance U. Go. Here triangle, these see these two triangles A dash, B dash, C and ABC. They are similar triangles. They have these Vertical opposite angles 90 and 90 degree. So they are similar triangles. And as you have studied in class 10 maths, if two triangles are similar, then their proportional sides are equal. Like iski height upon iski height, iska base upon iska base are equal. Now see these two triangles A dash, B dash, C and ABC are similar. So Iski height A dash B dash upon iski height A B. Then iska base B dash C upon iska base C B are equal. Similarly, I have drawn this normal from point Q on principal axis at N. And see these two triangles are also similar. A dash B dash F and Q and F. So they are also similar. Again, iski height a dash b dash upon iski height q n. Iska base f b dash upon iska base n f. Point to be noted q n is equal to a b. So q n equals to a b. So I'll replace q n with a b. Now for paraxial rays, that, that means the rays close to principal axis. n f is nearly equal to p f. So I replace NF with PF. Now see equations 1 and 2. The left hand sides are same. So right hand side must also be same. So B dash C upon CB is equal to FB dash upon PF. Now we will convert all these distances uh, from pole. Like this B dash C. B dash C. Write it PC minus PV dash PC minus PV dash now CB CB write it PB minus PC PB minus PC now FB dash write PB dash minus PF PB dash minus PF point to be noted all the distances must be taken from pole so write PB not BP okay now this we got it. Now we'll put the values. Now see P B it is U. But since it is opposite to incident ray, so we'll take it minus U. P V dash minus V image distance. P F minus F focal length. P C radius of curvature minus R. And R is equal to 2F, so it becomes minus 2F. Now we will put these values in equation 3. P at PC minus 2F. PB dash minus V. PB minus U. PC minus 2F. PB dash minus V. PF minus F. Now just open the bracket. Then do the cross multiplication. 2F square will cancel. Bring these both terms with F on right left hand side and we get Vf plus Uf equal to Uv. 
Now divide it by UVF. We get divided by UVF. So here VF got cancelled, here UF and here UV. And finally we get 1 upon F equals to 1 upon U plus 1 upon V, which is called spherical mirror formula. Now we study linear magnification. See, I have joined one ray from A to P, which after reflection will pass from A dash. Now see this triangle A dash, B dash, P and A, B, P. They are also similar triangle. Angle I is equal to angle R and this 90 and this 90. So triangle A dash, B dash, P and triangle A, B, P are similar. So is ki height A dash, B dash upon is ki height A, B. Is ki height P, B dash upon uski height PV. Now I will put the values. AB is the object size, size of object. Since it is erect, we will take it plus so. Then A dash B dash, it's inverted image, so we will take minus I. PV is object distance minus U. PV dash is image distance minus V. Using the equation 5, we get minus i plus o minus v minus u. So i upon o is equal to minus b upon u. And as you know, size of image to the size of object is called linear magnification. So m equals to minus v by u. So finally, in spherical mirrors, linear magnification small m is i by o, yani size of image to the size of object equal to minus b by a. Thank you.